last episode of Yozakura was peak rom-com. Actually, if this show was just rom-com like that, I think I would enjoy it. Then again, it's not like it's only like a spy action battle. There's like different elements of the story and sometimes there is a rom-com. So I thought it was funny. My favorite part was the biker gang, you know, couple where they look so rugged and tough. But at the end of the day, you know, it was like their first date. So it was like, ooh, I don't know, seeing like the gap moe and seeing hardened character like that and seeing the little ooh part was hilarious for me. I think we got introduced to another character who is like an insider cop for us, right? Our big brother Kyochiro is like, they're like childhood friends or something. And I expect to get to a new arc. Let's begin today's reaction. Someone's moaning, breathing hard while typing. What? She, she's, she's, she's typing some fanfic. I think she's fucking typing up some fucking... What does this say? Beautiful program. The magic of hacking. So this girl is doing Hacker Man right now. She's actually getting horny off of typing though. And then here's our big sis, who's a gamer. Who I'm sure is also good at hacking. Her diet is just potato chips and fucking energy drinks, bro. So unhealthy. She hacked! She hacked her 80 hours of work! Oh no! Big sis toads. Uh... It's a hacking war right now. Shio doesn't even use a keyboard. She uses like an N64 controller. Sorry, like the older versions. Did she just unplug her computer? <laughs> this is basically visualizing for us how the hacking works, right? Basically, this is big. Bro this is big sis Shio versus the hacking girl right now. <laughs> this is because like it's kind of be boring to show like different code and numbers on the screen. She's getting out of here. <laughs> Tayo! <laughs> Mutsumi have competition? She owns toes again. Bug. <laughs> like three all nighters back to back to back. Okay, so the hacker girl in the beginning hacked the database for Tayo's pictures because she is obsessed with Tayo. Mutsumi has competition. They got a bunch of pictures. Access for our siblings. Maybe someone leaked it. She down bad for Tayo. <laughs> the fuck? It's her! Wait, she's a hacker and... One of the coolest thing is that she was like a hedgehog, right? Her, uh, her web, her model in the, uh, in, in whatever cyber world it was, it was like a hedgehog, right? Needles, like the needles here too, like the thematics, it all match. This skin tight black suit. This is a girl, right? It's not a trap, right? It's a girl, right? <laughs> Taiyu just pulling out that gun so casually will never get old to me, bro. Alright. Breath shaking. <gasps> Girl guess softly. Master Tayo? We mean Master Tayo. Yandere? Yandere, right? Wait, wait, wait. Is this not like the iconic uh, Yandere I picture? Like, like basically any girl that does this is a reference to Mirai Nikki, Future Diaries girl, right? This is the face of every fucking Yandere girl. <laughs> what the? <laughs> this is like one piece level of like body aesthetic. It's like, how is this possible? How how the fuck is a body like this possible? <laughs> Ayaka Kirisaki, Manhunter. Spy. This girl is insane, dude! <laughs> She's trying to kill you and stick you with needles? We got a bounty for 100k? That's a, that's a pretty good picture, I guess. I don't know. I expect like a goofy picture. It is kind of goofy. Yeah, he's making like a stink face. I don't know. Like in One Piece, the bounty pictures for, you know, people, something that's funny. What the fuck? Oh, what the? <laughs> Listen, I think that um, stalking a guy that you love so that you can stick them full of needles to kill them is fucking insane, bash it crazy, but 
She's a pretty fun character. <laughs> her facial reactions, they're pretty funny. I like her. She's very fun. Hopefully, she's not like an actual villain. I don't think she is. I think that maybe this could be like a fun ally to have that starts off as enemies. <laughs> <laughs> yes, she is. Wow. So nice. He's such an ethical person. Kai is such a good citizen. <laughs> Mutsumi! <laughs> so, Ayaka is basically glazing. Mutsumi is like, yeah, he is pretty good, right? <laughs> I'm scared of you still. But didn't you know? <laughs> Promise Kyochiro. Big bro, what? And then Big Bro said yes? You motherfucker. This is basically another training session for us. Fucking Big Bro basically ordered the hit, bro. He accepted it. Yeah, Big Bro is usually always the one, you know, fucking shit up. Did he? Oh, that's how, you know, Shion said, you know, no one in her family, like only the people in her family knows the code. How the fuck did she get in? Big Bro Kyochiro. You know, Big Bro, you're taking this a little bit too casually. I can't believe you just let her do that shit. Well, she is a big threat right now, but you know, in the future, I don't think she's like an actual villain. <laughs> wait, 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 you're leaving? Fuck you. How am I supposed to get out of here? You fucking... You're about to leave? So you like coat the entire place with needles that I can't walk around to make it annoying? And then you just leave? Fuck you! Alright. Well, shit. Are we gonna step on this guy too? The Twitch. Maybe it doesn't matter. Transfer student! But you guys don't realize how crazy she is. Right beside Tayo. Right beside Tayo. I guess very oh well that was it. <laughs> yeah, nice. She's fun though. This is really spicing up the environment. Ah, that would have hurt a lot. That would have hurt a lot. <laughs> the ball. Oh <laughs> shit. Your feelings are lethal weapons. Metal pins designed to kill someone. Actual assassin stuff. What do you mean I won't I accept your feelings? You're fucking crazy. <laughs> She's so cute though. Huh? No, no, needle doll. She must be able to control them with this. And it's like acupuncture and then it actually injured, right? All right. She's insane. This power is cracked. You can just control people like that. Is the needle still in them? How do we like free them? Shoot them all with the gun. Looney Tunes! Oh, it's that guy again. The one that twitched. Tayo saves Ayaka here. Further Riz. And then Ayaka will be like, okay, I won't kill you. What's going to happen? What's going to happen? Is Mutsumi going to save Ayaka? Tayo is probably going to do it somehow. Oh! Wait, 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 still. Second round, Tayo. That guy actually shot out the bullet, though. R is like electric bullet. Why would Mutsumi save you or why would Tayo save you? Yeah, Mutsumi wasn't super against, you know, her obsession in the alleyway. Maybe the target shifted. <laughs> is it gonna go Yuri route now? Is she gonna try to kill her now every time? <laughs> True love, no! <laughs> You've known her for like 10 minutes! Does that mean she's gonna try to kill them? Uh... It's actual Yuri. I like this. This is nice development. This is fun. I, I like this. I hope she's like Mutsumi's like personal bodyguard. <laughs> I thought Mutsumi was gonna get cucked today. I thought that this is a new girl. Everyone's gonna be hype. But it's like, no. Tayo's the one that got cucked. What the fuck? She wanted to be an ice cream for her. 
She's a mini big bro? Yeah, what happened to that? Okay, so that's still happening. Does that really make sense anymore? What? You've been ensnared at last. Oh, <laughs> Goliath actually has a fucking medkit ready, bro. Probably got a defibrillator to fucking jumpstart his heart. Your life is in danger every episode. Ultra Yozakura family. This is just Mario. Super Mario. Kill him! Super Mario with Kyochiro being the enemy. Koopa! Koopa Kyochiro! This, this, this is actually so cute. The last time I saw models like this was, I think, is in um, Yamada-kun. The video game characters in their chibi mode look like this. So, we're actually just gaming? We're just chilling. Congratulations! Woo! What? We just stopped the train. The train just come to a halt. Did we just do this by playing the game? Has Shion gamified the whole act of spy missions? She actually gamifies the missions. That's actually so fun. That's so much better, dude. We're doing actual missions, but playing a game. Hardcore. Mm. Uh, yo, 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 how are you gonna stop this? By gaming! <laughs> what are we gonna do? <laughs> it's just all the assets are just Kyochiro, bro. <laughs> but this is basically the chopper. We have one res. I love this little game she on chibi mode, man. Tayo, you gotta jump. Tayo. Tayo, you gotta jump. That is a literal... Yo, yo, yo. This is a speedrunning strat for, like, Super Mario stuff. Is that a Splatoon reference? Because this also happens... I only say Super Mario reference because, like, in um, Super Mario 64, the speedrunning, basically there's this thing called where you get to clip the wall, where if you hit, like, a specific frame at a specific timing against the wall, you can traverse the entire solid path, but apparently you can do that in Splatoon 2. <laughs> okay, what is this? What reference is this? As soon as I saw these little muscular legs, I was like... <laughs> <laughs> is he even trying to use glitches? I don't think he is, right? Just fuck shit up, you know. One punch! Really? One punch? This character is busted. <laughs> Tayo's still so jacked, bro. Why does he have a tail? Now what? There's more? Bakana! Gamer moment! What's he gonna do with the res? Resurrect the dragon by riding it. How does this make any sense? Don't worry about it. This is a gamer move for sure, absolutely. Yep, it just makes sense. So everything right now is perfect. Sure. All from just clicking a button, guys. Just clicking the same goddamn button. It's our hedgehog, the pink hedgehog. Hacking techniques. <laughs> what is he? <laughs> programming explained. No shot that if you're reading books saying you programming, you can't just hack like this, but it's an enemy. Who could Big Bro Kyochiro just like... Because he has all of Mutsumi's pictures. He, if, does Ayaka know this? 
Ayaka, Big Bro Kyochira could be like using Ayaka by just offering her all these different pictures that she has. He has, right? He definitely could. <laughs> Everyone is just fucking button nasty, just clicking the same fucking button and just, just hacking, bro. Teamwork! Woo! What the? Xiong doesn't look very. Wait, no, she is, please. Yeah, I don't know what went down either. You were just clicking a button. GJ, I think she reverse hacked. I don't know. Also, Gordias was also here. Emotional support. My brain was definitely glitching watching this episode. Like, what the fuck was going on, bro? Honestly, better than the other shit that we've had to do here. Guys, you guys probably should not be doing all-nighters like this. It's actually so dangerous for your health. Like, when you're a kid doing all-nighters, Probably not that big of a deal, but as you start to get older and older, these all-nighters will actually do irreversible brain damage. Not even joking, but that's today's episode. What was today's episode? Um, it was basically a mix of introducing a new character known as Ayaka, and she is a hacker who uses all these cool, you know, needles, and basically her thing is she finds the person that she's in love with, then she kills them. Because that's how she shows her affection. She's a yandere hacker. She's great. She's fun. And the twist is that she just, you know, <laughs> just fell for Mutsubi instead. So Tayo is actually the one that got cucked instead of Mutsubi. I don't really understand the logic behind why she's not also trying to kill Mutsubi. Because, you know, she's her entire thing is kill the person you love. But she's a fun addition to her roster. I'm glad that we have her. The second half was basically showing us how Mr. Sorry, Miss Shion, our big sister, operates. How does she do her missions if she's just a gamer and doesn't come outside? She gamifies it. Somehow she can synchronize the games that we're playing with the spy missions. And by beating the game, we also beat the missions. It's pretty fun, you know? And everyone got involved and that's it. I'm still kind of wanting like an actual arc to happen, right? But usually what happens with Shonen Jump type of shows is that the early game, right? It takes a while to kind of get us started. But this is like a 24, 26 episode like uh season i think right so i think we're gonna have a lot of time for actual arcs to begin hopefully that happens next episode but that's it for me if you're still here if you did enjoy this reaction please like the video check out the other playlist for more content and until next time take care